When I host at home, it's always about focusing on wine. And this means preparing for the moment and checking out what wines to drink. I like to pick a lot of different bottles so people can try different things. Sometimes I come up with a theme. It could be a country, it could be a grape type, it could be a wine style. Let's do Pinot Noirs or something. Or it could just be really cool wines I've recently had and I think someone would really enjoy. People think about storing wines at constant temperatures, relatively constant humidities, but they forget about sunlight protection. It's actually something really important that people often overlook. I realized over the years that, sure, it's fantastic to find that perfect food and wine marriage, but sometimes we should think more about the wine and the people pairing. When I entertain, I love to have a bunch of glasses on the table full of different wines. I don't mind sometimes tasting a red wine and then going back to a white, because wine's a living thing. It changes all the time. And so the wine you tasted 15 minutes ago can be different as it changed in your glass with air or it got a little warmer. If you're dining outside, you want to think about lighter wines that show well when they're a little bit chilled. And I think the later you go into the evening, you tend to drink richer and more powerful wines. When you're serving wine for a party or event, you want to have a crescendo. You want to start out with a simple wine, and then you want to work up to more serious ones, and then finish with a perfect bottle that really highlights the whole evening and makes it so memorable.